the monkeys are a pest. And I am really serious. I think that those people who are promoting the monkeys, as to say that how, you know, uh, we should not interfere with them, this kind of stuff, they are doing this a disservice to our country, okay? They are not recognizing the fact that one of the main constraints to increasing agricultural production is the presence of, presence of monkeys. And they're even uh, now attacking herbs. Herb, her, herbs, you know, and this is, this is unfortunate. And I, I really, at this point, I need to think that we, I, I, I you know, for this to say this, I really, I, I admire the Antiguans for the fact they don't want to exterminate them. And maybe we need to the point that we do a serious culling of these animals in Barbados. Because it is, it is, they are getting to the point where they are a, a true menace, okay, to increasing agriculture, agriculture production and fruits. If we are serious, for instance, we, we, we want to talk about the fact that we are serious about food security. How can we, in one breath, say we are serious about food security, and in the same breath, encourage a pest that is actually undermining our food security, and then you get apologists trying to make a case for them. In the, in, and you know, unfortunately, these people come to the UK and they don't tell you the truth. They cull animals up there, okay? They have their fox hunts and everything else, and they cull them. So it is a kind of a double standard to me. When these people from the developed countries coming down here and trying to read the right out of animal rights and all kind of stuff, okay, being hypocritical about it, okay, and we taking it as the gospel. That is not, it's not necessarily so. We need, if we are serious about making sure that Bajans have livelihoods, okay, and that they can produce food, we need to reduce the population of monkeys to a considerable degree because they are a pest, they are constrained on agriculture production in many ways, okay, we can be, we can, we can be producing more and lowering the price of food even more and making it even more readily available to Barbadians. But because we have that monkey pest, okay, it is preventing people from doing what they need to do. And even in terms of providing food for themselves, there are instances where people plant crops in their gardens and these things come across and pull them up. That is not something that we should tolerate. And I really think that we need to go to a point of extermination Okay, culling these animals in a very serious way, and people need to stop thinking that somehow the agricultural sector can do what it needs to do in the presence of, of, of a large number of monkeys who are marine pests and do not give farmers a chance, okay, to be able to plant them.